A war of words is erupting tonight as there's yet another delay for TN Ready. Once again, some districts are having to delay testing this time for part two of the exam. Our Cuthbert Langley continues his coverage of the story. And Cuthbert, is this the last time that this will be delayed? Do we even know? Carrie, that's a great question. And the Department of Education says yes, they will not test students past May 10th. They say the vendor has once again failed to deliver the right testing materials for elementary and middle schools. But for the first time, we're hearing from that vendor who says they have only been able to use one printer to print more than one million testing booklets. TN ready is still ain't ready. Leave it to frustrated lawmakers to boil it down. The statewide exam is not ready. The test was supposed to be done online in February, but the state says that system failed and they switched to paper test. There was then a delay for that first part, and now there's a delay again. You just can't take the test offline and put it on a printing press. Measurement Inc., the test vendor, says the state has given them an impossible task. Print nearly one million booklets and answer sheets in a few months' time. We're not failing to deliver. We are delivering as fast as, as possible. But those deliveries are late again. Several districts were supposed to start testing on Monday. Now they'll have to wait. It looks like we ought to get them all out during next week, if we get all the answer sheets tomorrow. But when we pushed more to see if they'll start delivering tomorrow, the answer seemed less likely. I wouldn't bet the house on it. Those lack of answers led to frustration on the last day of the legislature. I'm fed up with it, and we don't need to do anything else to give them any authority for anything. And we've also learned the vendor has only been using one printer. That's because the two others they could use were booked by the time the state switched to those paper tests. And while the state is blaming the vendor, Measurement Inc. wasn't so clear. That, that'll be a, a discussion for <coughs> another day. Right now, it's unclear what happens if school districts are unable to get testing in by May 10th. The Department of Education says they'll provide more information about that in the future. Carrie. What a mess. Thank you, Cuthbert. Again, this newest delay only applies to elementary and middle schools. High school testing will begin next week.